Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. Today's video is Vlogtober Day. All right, so I'm here back at work picking up Sky. All right, so we're um, heading up the mountain right now. I have Sky in the car with me. Carter's Mountain is located in Charlottesville, Virginia. Carter's Mountain Orchard overlooks the dramatic vistas and acres of fruit trees and grapevines. Mere minutes from downtown Charlottesville and just down the road from Monticello, Thomas Jefferson's home. The orchard welcomes visitors year-round. The hours are varying um, throughout the seasons, and so just plan accordingly. If you plan to go this fall, you can visit between 9 a.m. and 6 p.m. Weekends are ticketed, which just means that anyone over the age of 12 is paying for a ticket to get through and up the mountain. When you're planning ahead, always look on the website to see what apples you can come up and pick or the ones that you can get pre-picked. Up here at the barn, which you guys will see in just a second, is a great awesome barn that has everything that you need in the fall it has pumpkins it has wine slushies it has apple cider slushies they also sell um, apple cider in the gallons half gallons and pint they also have apple cider donuts in half a dozen or a dozen they also do apple pie which you can get single serve slices of you can also get that in half a pie or a whole pie they also do things up here such as like honey butter, um, apple butter, um, different types of barbecue sauce and um, sometimes you can go out and pick the apples which is most of the time but if you don't want to you don't have to and I think that 30 minutes before they close they will not let anyone out into the orchard to go and pick apples. So it is a three to four minute drive up the hill which is well worth it except not when it is busy because when it is busy you might have to um, merge off to the right as you guys see here um, which will bring you around the back of the barn now this is the way to get to the front of the barn and you can park anywhere you please when you park you're gonna have a scenic view of um, the actual city itself All right, so we made it here to the barn. I'm not sure why it's so dark in here, but anyways, we're gonna get ready to get out. We have our wagon, um, and I'm gonna go see if we can try to go pick a couple apples real quick. If not, we'll just have to get the pre-picked and get us some donuts, pie, something, cider, something. All right, so we got the wagon. The high school is down there. Anyways, this is just a way to keep up with you. Same pace. Kinda. You wanna walk now? You wanna get out and walk? Definitely take note that picking conditions can change day by day and even hour to hour. It just depends upon the weather and the customer traffic. The types of apples that you guys can either go up and pick your own or do the pre-picked um, are the following. There are 13 that are available. Ambrosia, Candy Crisp, Crispin, Fiji, Gala, Golden Delicious, Granny Smith, Honey Crisp, Jonah Gold, 
Jonathan, Red Delicious, Stay Man, and Wine Sap. They also have pumpkins available that are only pre-picked. Some of the other apples are a hit or a miss um, for you to pick your own or already have pre-picked. They do come in different prices. Um, the little blue containers that you guys see here is your cheaper price. Your next price that you're probably going to run into is the ones that are um, in the smaller bags which could probably run you anywhere from like 12 to 18 dollars per bag um, so sometimes if you're you know wanting to mix it up this is the place to go but i would say if you're using apples to make smaller things such as apple butter or apple pumpkin butter or applesauce i would just stick with your local food line or kroger whole foods whatever um, for your apples because they can get pricey so not only did they do apples and pumpkins but they also have other things up there you know, like hats shirts puzzles um, and then things like um, gummies for the season um, mini jack pumpkins and gourds um, if you're into that type of stuff as well as like barbecue sauces um, stuff to make um, apple crisp and other things like that.
as long as you don't buy anything, I think you're safe to come in here with me. Hey! Oh my God! <laughs> there we go. I got you. Huh? It smells so good in here. Let's see. These two on the end is what you have: blueberry, pomegranate, and beech. Yeah. Okay. Um, can I do beach bellini, please? And I, I yep, I have my ID. Thank you. Did I throw my car back down in here? Yep. Oh my god. Okay, there we go. Okay. Straws are here, they're open at the bottom. Did it did it do it? I have an at all today, so I'm surprised it works. Yep. So. <laughs> I'm at that point. Do you need a receipt? No, thank you. Okay. I just need I this. Look. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Thank you. Yeah. Teacher life. Yes. Yeah. Woo. Okay. We'll go back out this way. I know it's on. I'm putting it. I'm putting it on you. <laughs> yeah. She got her cocktail. <laughs> Crazy. That isn't it. What it's called? The peach cocktail. I got like two cup holders, yeah. Anyways, I got me a beach bellini. What do you have? Is it good? Is it good? Okay, so I got a apple cider slushy, half dozen apple cider donuts, and a single slice of apple pie to go. Sky, what did you get? Squirrel and it's vanilla and peach. Cool. All right, y'all, so that concludes our trip up to Carter's Mountain. We had a blast, just me and Skye. Now it's time to 
head on back down the hill around the corner to our destination. All right, here we go. Okay, y'all, so we definitely had a lot of fun up here um, at Carter's Mountain. It's always um, a blast coming up here, especially when it's not crowded. So, of course, like, straight after work, boom, not crowded, not busy. Um, anyways, wine slushies are $9. Um, I really feel like they need some new flavors other than beach bellini and blueberry pomegranate but it's gonna work for me anyways i'll catch you guys at another time or yeah if you've enjoyed watching this video so far please be sure to give it a thumbs up consider hitting that subscribe button down below and also comments in down below i'll see you guys in the next vlog